Congratulations. Well done, buddy. Let me go there, finish Kendra is inside. Just a few more yards. You're in the home straight. Well done. You're right. Keep going. Well, done, well done, sir. From the Pool Athletics Club. Well done. Good turn out for them today, along with their colleagues and pool winners. Overall. Yeah. Head up, keep smiling. There's always a camera sure. somewhere. No turning across the line, please. <laughs> and we've got another girl, uh, Pat Simpson's coming in soon as well. She'll be the next lady in. Well done. Cool on camera. They're looking good. Well done. Here we go. I'm going to dance for you. And it's all over. Well done to you. Here's our winner. Take a lift, get that medal. Speed it up, 469, well done to you. In the meantime, well done to you, madam. But also, people are done to James Barley in the marathon. Well done, James. It turned. Oh, so right, thanks. Hello, mate. Come closer, you two. Come closer, come closer, come closer. So this is this is Lisa and Tracy. Uh, Lisa was fourth overall, second lady, I think. Is that right? And Tracy, you not only were first lady, you won the whole thing. Come closer so I can hear you on the camera. Okay. How'd you feel? Glad I finished. But yeah. It was lovely. It was fantastic. Beautiful out there. Really hard technical places, but it is a technical route, isn't yeah, it? Did that really sap technical. your legs? Um, not too bad because I try trained for the downhill sections because uh, that really does nothing. It your legs, didn't work. It so was, you your quads weren't walloped yeah, by the as, end. No, not as bad as I have had in the past. But um, it was very technical, so I was a little bit more cautious on the rocky stuff. What other stuff have you done before, Tracy? Um, I did the five, four, three, two, one. Uh, the uh, Salisbury yeah, run, yeah. Yeah, that was the thirty, the fifty k. I did that. Yeah. Did the Uza and the Hillstone and. And uh, what's your general? positioning been like in those uh, right okay good when was your first ultra or your first uh, long race my first well my longest race was the source of the 54321 50k, 50K. Yeah. That's my longest race, yeah okay i come from an iron man background so. ah okay so right have you have you dropped the iron man in favor of doing long distance running um, I have had a break from yeah. Yeah, just purely down to time and uh, you get value for time with running and it's just yes that's right do you, would you recommend this this uh, Perbeck marathon to other people? Oh yeah, definitely. Is it? Do you think it's one of the? I mean, I you know I love it. I, I think it's one of the most stunning routes that I run. But I don't know what other people think. Oh, well, it was so beautiful doing it because it was completely clear and you could just see for miles. Yeah, we were lucky with the weather. Stunning, and I was running with a guy from London for a bit, and I, he was just like you know because. I'm quite local, I'm Wimbledon. So yes, you're uh, Dorset Dodler? Dorset Dodler, yeah, that's right, yeah. So, um, Lisa, don't go away. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so, um, what was I saying now? Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, running around here, we're kind of a bit spoilt, really. It's but, gorgeous, um, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Well, I look forward to seeing you again at another race and another top finish. Well done, Tracy. Thank you very much. First place in the marathon. Not only first woman, but first overall. Tra uh, Lisa, come and say hello. It was a busy, busy running weekend. So we, I caught you were the first person I caught coming down the hill at Corf because uh, I only just made it there in time. Um, how are you feeling? You look very fresh, actually. Can you come a bit clo come, come closer to the mic so we can hear you? Um, yeah, you, you look good. Do you feel okay? Have you done it before? Yeah, this is my third time of the marathon. I've done the 16 once. As well. Okay, yeah. I mean, I do. I, I kind of recognise you from previous I races elsewhere as well. Yeah. What, how many, what number marathon is this for you? I think it's about 137 ish. So, do you normally run in your 100 Club vest? No. You don't? 
Um, I normally run incognito. Do you? Right. I, <laughs> because I, I've got an outrageous amount of running clothes and it'd be a shame not to wear <laughs> So you go through them all one by one. Yeah. How did you find it today? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I love it. It's one of my favourite places. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll come back every year to do it. That's what I do anyway. Good stuff. Well, thank you very much. Well done today. So, fourth place overall, second lady. Congratulations. Thanks, Lisa. And Kat Simpson's just coming in. Well done, Kat. Well done, Kat. So, uh, podium place for Kat, I think, in third. And uh, get some fruit, plenty of fruit there. And if you can find a bit of shade, get in the shade. That's a 4.06 finish for Kat. Kat, you missed four hours for goodness sake. What are you playing at? Are you alright? Dust. Yeah, it's quite dry out there, isn't it? It's hot. Yeah, that it's dusty trail going like up out of Corf. Yeah, all the, all the Nordic walkers. Oh, did, you were passing Nordic walkers on the way, were you? They were coming the other way. Oh, okay. <laughs> did I see your dad? Mm. I'm sorry, I'm interviewing you while you've got a mouthful of orange juice. <laughs> orange juice. <laughs> Oh dear, Kat, uh, Kat runs for the uh, uh, Centurion team. I just got a Centurion vest on now. You were, were you not invited to James's 100 mile? Yeah, I'm doing the 24 hour world championship. All oh, right, okay. Okay. Fair enough. I wondered why you weren't there. Well, I was due to run it, and then Jason said, "Why don't you do the 10k and do some more filming?" So here I am doing filming rather than running. And I always do rubbish on this, like 440 every year is ridiculous. It's hard, isn't it? Oh, is it? I... No, it is tougher than beachy head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep the first half really steady and do it to effort. Yes. Take it quite easy, and then then towards the end it caught up with me a bit. Yeah. I'll go and have a rest, Kat. Well done. So, uh, third place for Kat today at the. It is gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Uh, so that is uh, the first place, second place, and third place runners through for the girls. Um, Kat Simpson in third and we had Lisa in second and Tracy not only first female but winner of the whole thing so that's amazing well done to the girls today awesome running and we are just now waiting for other marathon and I think there's still some 16 16 runners coming in still how many 16 runners are coming in still and we've got we've had the first sort of five or six of the marathon, marathon are in. Runners. We've got the first and second females in. We've got the first, second and third males in. Good stuff. So we, just okay. so we still yeah, so we still have got 16 runners coming in. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Last few yards and it's all over. That's it. Hold hands, come on, catch them up. Well done. You've got to cross the line together after all that way. From the pool runners, well done. Team effort. That's going to make a great picture. So we'll just keep our eyes on the finish line for a few more minutes and then we'll maybe go and have a wander around and a chat to a few people.
last few yards you're in the home straight have a little look up and you'll see the F word it says finish keep it going last few yards and it's all over keep smiling when you cross that line we love smiley faces here at Swanage well done well done Hey, well done to you, sir. Well done, running for Julia's house. Julia's house is a children's hospice in Dorset and Wilshire. We got a marathon man coming in. We've got Paul Who are you? I am staff from Paul Runners. I've got salt on my face. <laughs> How did you find it today? You did the 16? Yeah, yeah we did the 16. It was all right, wasn't it? Hot, but... You camera hugger. We managed, yeah. yeah. We did, we did. And we, we love the Coke. Well, 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 you love the what? Uh, Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Coca oh, well, in hot weather, I think Coke is one of the only things that oh, suits, isn't it? It got us through, down. and it's in the goodie bag. So have you done the Perbeck 16 before? Yeah. You have, I haven't. You've done it before. Yeah. Was it just as good as you remember? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he knew too much. He kept telling me about the hills. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so he didn't keep saying to you, oh, there's a lovely view yeah, coming up here, yeah. a lovely view coming oh, up there. There's one more little hill, and then a little hill on top of that, and then down, and then another hill. <laughs> it's about the <laughs> But I heard you say just over there off camera, I, I actually enjoyed that. I do actually enjoy it. Even with me. I like to complain on the race, but I wasn't too bad today. Good, good. <laughs> What's your name? Steph. And? Steph and Paul. Paul, well done. Paul. Steph and Paul, awesome job. Pool runners, well done. Thank you very much. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> the record's gone. That's been no man. That's all right. You're supposed to be. I'm supposed to be filming you. <laughs> all right, so when the runners finish, they'll come over here. They get the medal and the goodie bag and then there's plenty of fruit and water for them to drink. And as I said to you before, look, first aid medical cover is right there, should anyone need it. Beautiful day in uh, Swanage today. And I don't know if you can see okay, uh, over up. there in the distance, that's the hill that we started on earlier on this morning. Together, run the marathon, how good is that? This is Gary and this is Jack. And keep smiling for the pictures. Look to your right, Gary and Jack. There you go, father and son, watch out for them dogs. <laughs> so the we saw these guys at Corf. In the meantime, madam, look up, you've done your challenge. Gary, Jack. Well done, she's happy. She's punching the air. It's all over, she says. Thank you for Well done. Come and chat to me when you've got your stuff. I should have took the dogs off you, shouldn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Well, what a great combination. Just come round this side. So, who, which one's Gary and which one's Jack? Gary. Gary, Jack. So, is it your fault that he runs? Amos is going to do it. Amos He started the marathon and I had to sort of join in. Oh, okay. Oh, so he's, he's tried to better you and you've well, tried to keep up. Is what... When he does it, it's a race. When I do it, it's an event. Yes. Yeah, so. uh, yeah, I'm with you. <laughs> Uh, so, what prompted you to do this one? Uh, everybody said amazing scenery. And? It is. absolutely <laughs> amazing. It's stunning. I mean, the weather's amazing. Yeah. The first half on the coast was unbelievable. It's incredible, isn't it? And then you come to Corfe Castle as well. Yeah, that's where, that where I saw you earlier on. Yeah. Beautiful view from there. Um, how did you feel running? You look fresh. Yeah, I'm fine. Um, your dad, I mean, you know. <laughs> no, he's all right. He's, co he's coped. <laughs> <laughs> no, you look good. Yes. Well, yeah. Did you, were you aiming for a time or did you just think we'll just get it done? Get it done. Whatever happens. Survival. How fast I can pull him round. <laughs> yeah. Do you run for club? 
no so you're just out for enjoyment enjoyment do you do you both actually run together quite regularly or not really yeah well, we did yeah, yeah, we did the snowdown your ultra okay uh, the ultra. what the actual uts uh, no we did the uh, so last year i did the snowdown your trail marathon yeah i won i won that so i got a free entry so i did the ultra this year yeah and i decided that he was going to do it with me <laughs> so oh no, what did you think when he said that to you what a lucky boy <laughs> <laughs> oh mate well what have you got now so now that you've done this together have you got another plan uh, retirement <laughs> no the only one we've got booked is next year we've got Giant's Head Giant's Head oh you're, Giant's Head if, if you're going to compare marathons Giant's Head and this one are almost equally as beautiful yeah. it's stunning stunning marathons both so you'll enjoy that one as well yeah. well done Gary and Jack fantastic thank you well, well done by the way if I didn't mention father and son just do that <laughs> thanks a lot well done got number seven zero I think Lisa no, hang on it's seven nine Hannah is that you Hannah it is Hannah hey, no problem, no problem. take care well done Hannah and Hannah's just and finished Lisa. well done Hannah well done finished well done you've done your challenge well done so all these all these marathon runners are marathon runners I caught at the top of Corf Castle charities uh, this weekend, the local charities. Well done, Hannah. How do you feel? Tired. I saw you at the, the top and you looked really fresh at Corf Castle. All you want is a donation. Go up and see them. Cup of tea, cup of coffee, piece of cake. So another marathon runner coming in here. It's an oh no, this is a 60. Is it a 60 mile or a marathon? For, for his his bib well looks more yellow than green. Well done, sir. But yeah, we did catch this guy. Number 21 well, from Yeovil in. Runners. Still smiling. We love it. And runners crossing the line with smiley faces. Well done, buddy. How do you feel? Awful. Awful? <laughs> you looked all right at Corf Castle. Yeah, I was dying to death after that, though. That last yeah, drag. That, that last little drag up the hill. Yeah. yeah. It goes on forever. It does, doesn't it? You never seem to come down, do you? No, I don't. What's it? 20 hot degrees? Yeah, yeah. Terrific. Well done. Good job, mate. Well done. Smiles and thumbs up. There's another 16 miler finishing. How are you, sir? I'm pleased it's all over. Yeah. I'm glad I've done it. What did you th What did you think of the route? I loved it. Yeah. It Have you done hard. anything like that before? Never. It's the furthest I've ever run. Yeah. Come down on holiday. Came down last year, watched it, thought I've got to have some of that. I recognise the running top. Burgess Hill Runners. Burgess Hill Runners. You're not far from me in Worthing. Fair play. Yeah. Really well, like what's it. your name? Mick. Mick. Uh, longest you've ever run yet? Uh, yeah, longest I've ever run, And yeah. I'm guessing that was the most beautiful run you've ever done. Absolutely, yeah. In preparation for Beachy in uh, end of October. Oh, well done. Well, I'll see you there. Thank you so Take much. Take care. Well done today. Appreciate it. So a lot of runners use other races, other marathons to prepare for ones coming up. It's sometimes easier to do a race in training than to go out, get up in the morning, seven o'clock in the morning and get out for your own solo training run. If you've got the motivation to get out of bed and go and run a race, it's sometimes a little bit easier. So that's what a lot of runners do. They do a race in preparation for a race. Another marathon runner coming in. Is that 169? Oh, wow, what a big, big number that is. Roland Hall, what happened to you, Roland? Roland's only done the marathon. Well done, Roland. Well done, Roland. Good job. How'd you feel? Yeah, crap. <laughs> <laughs> That's been polite. <laughs> but did you enjoy it? Well, listen, five minutes' time, you'll, have say, you'll say you enjoyed that. Well done, mate. Well, well done, Kevin. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry. Good on you, Roland. I remember this guy most of the way. Yeah, fantastic. Uh, yeah. All right. That's, yeah. Actually, that's what a lot of runners do, is they pal up on a long runs like this, and they'll run together to keep give each other motivation and support. Yeah, yeah definitely. So you're absolutely knackered. Yeah. 
Got it in a good way. Yeah, it's a good way. A lovely run. Beautiful scenery. Yeah. Absolutely well organised. Great stations, great signposts. Have you been to this marathon before? No, first time. Coming again? Yeah, I probably would. <laughs> I'd probably train a bit harder. Yeah, well, it does. It is tough, isn't it? It's a tough run, That's isn't time, it? Yeah, that last hill up there. Uh, yeah, out of course. Yeah, oh, yeah. Don't, yeah. Tell me about it. Yeah. It's horrible. Yeah, bring the bike horrible, back, but man. amazing. <laughs> no, it's really good. Well done, Roland. Thank Take you. care. Guys, brilliant as well. It was all over. Well Thank you. Thank you. We're in the home straight. Keep it going, last few yards. So another 16 miler coming in. I trip over there. Well done, keep going. Yeah, take a left, get an entry. Do you need a chair? No, I need some shade. Coming into the home straight there. He's looking good. He's a spar strider. He's John Paul Hunt and he's done a marathon. And uh, we've got another marathon finisher. Uh, Jonathan well says, sure did I fancy middle. entering Victoria for one of the races? Absolutely, Victoria would have and loved the 10k day. to be honest. And all the other things that go with it. We've done all the hard work. Okay, sir. Last few yards and it's all over. What a great number. Four, four, four. Well done. Keep that one. Well done. Now take a left and get a drink, get some fruit, get a, get a medal. Latest marathon runner to finish 81. Oh, thank you. Good job. Yeah, yeah. Not finished. Can I grab you a second? How'd you feel? Wonderful. Yeah, very yeah, good. Yeah, you, right now, you see, I get, I'm getting different responses. I'm getting people crossing the line going, I feel horrible. It, I, it was a brilliant run, but I feel awful. Yeah, I had a horrible phase, but I feel, feel good now, yeah. So you right. went through that kind of marathon thing of about yeah, two thirds yeah, of the way through, yeah. you're going to die a death. Yeah, and is, yeah. you got a second wind. Yeah. Who'd you run for? Uh, Spa Striders, Leamington Spa. Leamington Spa Striders, okay. So you're not local, is this a race that you've done before? Did the half last year. Okay. It's the first time I've done the full. And uh, please, you upgraded? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, coming yeah. back? Yeah, definitely. Well done, what's your name? John Paul. John Paul, oh yes, you shouted John Paul at me down the hill at Corfe, didn't you? Well done, John Paul, take care. So lots of activity here at the uh, finish line of the Purbeck 16 and the Purbeck Marathon. People just enjoying the sunshine now, having done their race. And uh, got another marathon runner coming in. Lots of girls doing really well today. And here's our friend, I, who I keep calling Sylvie, but I know she's not called Sylvie. She keeps telling me her name. She's done a hot, hard, hilly marathon. And she's done it in under four and a half. Yes, what's her name again? Serena. Serena. I keep calling her Sylvia. No. Serena. Well done. That's horrible. It's not horrible. It's lovely. You loved it. So, four hours, 24 minutes. It's all right. I think so. Just under half. Yeah. Well, you've beaten everyone I ever did. How do you feel? Yeah, right. yeah. You looked, you looked really good coming through course. That hill is the killer, isn't it? It's the hardest bit. Yeah. Yeah. Because you, you think you've got to the top, and then it just keeps going, doesn't it? So, in line with your expectations prior to the race, how do you feel? So stay rehydrated. I didn't know really what to expect, but. It was tough. Yeah. But it was great. The scenes were beautiful. 
Like you, every time you looked up, you saw something. Good. Good. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, amazing. Good stuff. Um, will you come back and do it again? That's the question. Gotta try and, be, gotta try, beat the time. You've got to beat the time, haven't you? Do you know what? Every time I've done it, I've got slower. Have you? Yes, every time. I know. <laughs> Oh, there's another turn Three around, nets. Yeah, Fantastic to meet you. you. Well done. Good to meet you yesterday and follow you through. Well done. Well done, Chris Turner. There is a gentleman out there called Mark Turner. Well done, buddy. In the meantime, one more through. Can I grab you, mate? Steve Noble, Ecton Heath Harriers. How do you feel? I feel good, yeah. Yeah? You look, well, you look absolutely whacked. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. That's more realistic. No, I mean, really well done. It's a tough run, isn't it? It is, yeah. Have you done it before? No. What, kind of mar what marathons have you done before? Just road runs. Oh, really? First trail. First trail, and you yeah. chose this? Yeah. Well done. <laughs> good grief. Well, you, you've got a good grounding now for future trail marathons oh, that's then. That's what I thought, yeah. That's what they're like. Set a bar, yeah. Yeah. Well, I would say, actually, this is, this is probably a bit tougher than your average trail marathon. I heard, yeah. I so, felt, yeah. Felt it. Well done. Were you aiming for a time? No, just finishing. Well, under four and a half hours is great for this race. Uh, let me tell you, just great, you well done, well done, mate. Five runners out there uh, with the name of Smith as a surname. I don't know if they're all one team or have never met each other, but that's interesting. And you've got a couple of Simpsons. No. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, we have got two Simpsons out there. We've got uh, we've got a lemon out there. <laughs> we've got oh dear, there's always one Gazzaro Whiskey. A couple of Wittenbergs. It's a tough old job, this, you know, trying to call these people in. Right, let's go and have a little wander around and say hello to a few people. And we'll take you up onto the uh, the uh, gantry up there where they you can wave people in as well. Here they come, they must have been running together, they're waiting for each other as they come in. They're waving to the family, which is what we love to see here in Swanage. The crowd are up on their feet. They're cheering them in, they're all smiling. They've done their challenge, and it's all over. Hold hands, ladies. Arms in the air, look, you just don't care. Woo! Well done. Now, don't run away. Get your medal, give it back. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hello, you. Hello, you. Hello, you. How'd you feel? All right, Megan? Good, good, hot. Enjoyable? Yeah, perfect route. Yeah, it is, isn't Lovely it? Really day. good. Well done, well That's done. Great. You loved it and you know you did, and you're coming back next year. <laughs> well done. James, all right? Yeah, your medal, sorry. Thank you. Yeah, medium, please. Okay. Oh, yeah, that is over. Listen, hot. You're wearing a UCMB top. You know what this is all about, mate. Yeah. Why do we sign up for it? I know. Why do we?